Hi, and welcome to the NSSA's Segment Length and Extensions tutorial. First, let me just state that there is no perfect length for all segments. The basic rule is to cut a segment between 3.5 and, and 6 seconds with the extension. However, when cutting segments, segmenters must take into account the subtitle character limit of 120 characters approximately, and try to imagine how the subtitle will appear. You also have to understand something about the language you're segmenting. Now, this doesn't mean you need to know Korean, Russian, or Spanish, but knowing the speed in which they speak is very important. What would be a normal four second segment in Korean, which is approximately six words, could be up to 10 to 12 words in Spanish. As a segmenter, we have to take these things into account. No one wants to read three lines of text on one segment if it can be avoided. So how do we adjust for this? We look at a few things each and every time we segment. One, what language are we segmenting? There is no hard rule, but the basics are for Korean and English. Most segment lengths will be between 3 and 5 seconds, just like this one, with a nice and easy to read subtitle. For Spanish and Russian, you'll likely go 2 to 4 seconds because their speech is so much faster. Look at how much they said in just a couple of seconds. For Chinese, Taiwanese, and Hong Kong shows, you will probably stick with 3 to 5 seconds as well, but they tend to have pauses in their speech, so be very careful as you can see here. These are not rules you need to write down, but keeping in mind the speech patterns of a language help you become a segmenter that the subtitlers will love. Number 2. What's happening? You'll also find that during an argument, your segging will be much more difficult. Speech will be faster, so you'll need shorter segments, and people will tend to talk over one another, so you need to be careful about your splits and combines. But that's another tutorial. As you can see here, in just four seconds, there were more than 20 words spoken when translated to English. If they're in a very deep and emotional conversation, you're likely to get several long pauses between words, so expect longer segments here. Just pay attention to the length of the pauses. As you can see here, this is a very slow conversation. We seg it a little bit longer, but keep to the basic rules of seg length. Now, number three is lyrics or music. While we don't like to see long segs, it's pretty much the opposite on music lyrics. Longer segments is better to fit the flow of the music. Segging for a full stanza usually is between 6 to 10 seconds, and as long as you keep to the same length throughout the song, this is totally acceptable. Now why do we comment about extension length so much? Well, if you were a viewer watching this video, would you be able to read these segments as fast as they pop on and off? Most of us wouldn't. That's why adding the 1 to 1.2 second extension at the end of a segment is very important. It's not always possible in conversations, but do the best that you can. So what is the easiest way to ensure you're leaving the proper extension? There are two very simple ways to check your segment length. First, while cutting your segment regardless of which method you use. I'll show you using a couple of different methods. Let's try the XXL segment method. Because we are making cuts off of one long segment, the best way to test for length is prior to cutting the segment. Listen to the comment and go a little ways past that. Then hit R to replay the segment from the beginning. Press F to pause as soon as the speaker is done talking. Now simply hit your right arrow key once and the green line will move to exactly one second past your paused point. If you hit the space bar right now and cut your segment, the extension length is perfect. Next, if you cut individual segments one at a time, checking your extension length at the end of the cut is best. First, cut your segment and put your extension on. Once you've cut your segment, hit the left arrow key. This will take you back exactly one second. Is the green line on the wave of speech, or is it way past the end of the speech? If so, adjust the end of your segment accordingly. In this example, the segment is too short because the green line is on the wave, indicating the speaker is still speaking. It's about 0.2 seconds on the speech, so I'll use Control plus up arrow twice to move the extension to the right place. Now hit the R and replay the segment. 
At the end, use your left arrow again. See how the green line now sits right at the end of the speech wave? It's perfect. Well, that's it for this lesson, and thank you for watching NSSA's Segment Length and Extension Tutorial.